morning. Welcome to your Tuesday this morning. I hope you've enjoyed the bank holiday weekend. It sort of stayed dry, didn't it, in most places? Yeah, for quite some nice of it. on Saturday. For some of it. Yeah, we can't complain too much. Yeah. It's very nice. A little bit spring-like. Uh, lots coming up today, but we are starting with a little bit of news. Uh, we're beefing up security around the studio. In fact, right now, outside, we've got our very own superhero patrolling the area. So, let's go and meet them, shall we? Let's cross live now to, I can't believe I can say this, Spider-Man. Good morning. Good morning, both. That's right. It's your favourite crime-fighting superhero, Spider-Man here, web-slinging my way around a television centre, making sure everything's all right. I don't remember Spider-Man having a Bristolian <laughs> No, outfit. I'm not sure he did. That's Josie. It's me. Are you, you're it was you. It's oh, me. Do you know, I have no idea. We had our suspicions, didn't we? <laughs> uh, so what's the real reason you're out there today? Holly, with great power comes great responsibility. That's the famous quote said to Peter Parker before he became one of our favourite superheroes, Spider-Man. But for me, it's taking a whole new meaning because today marks Spider-Man's 20th anniversary on the big screen and I'm going to be scaling that iconic wall right here at the television centre. There's the team at the top who are going to be helping me abseil down. Say hi, guys! There we are. Good luck. Good luck to me. Ah, but before I become this morning's very own Spider Jyoti, let's take a look back at 20 years of the incredible Spider-Man film. Not everyone is meant to make a difference. But for me, the choice to live an ordinary life is no longer an option. It's not a hug, I'm just grabbing the door for you. Oh, all right, kid. Good. good luck out there. Well, I've watched the films, I've got the outfit, and I've even met the most recent Spider-Man himself, Mr. Tom Holland. Let's just hope today's stunt goes better than that interview. I hope I you don't that. find this weird, but when I can't sleep at night, I watch interviews. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> With you and Zendaya. And do you know what? And when Zendaya said, they said, oh, how did you get out of the friend zone? And she said, well, you know what? You can just recognise kindness. And he's so kind. And I was like, oh, Oh, my that's heart. lovely. So yeah. I hope you don't think I'm too weird. No, 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 not at all. That's fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You can always count on the Gibson to make it a bit awkward, so join me just after 11 to see if I manage to web-sling my way down the wall you see behind me. Wish me luck! Very oh, best wish you of luck. luck. You are incredibly brave. I mean, in all seriousness, Josie, how are you with heights? Well, do you know what? I'll be honest, Holly, I've went for a bit of hypnotherapy. Did you? Yeah, because you it... lot kept putting me on them, so I've gone for a hypnotherapy now, how, so how, nothing How does it keep... feel? How do you feel now you've had your hypnotherapy? I feel, feel like Spider Woman. Whoa, it's clearly working. That's yeah. Hang on, that's am I am right in thinking she's not the only one that's done that, scaled down that wall? Do you know, I did a very long time ago, probably the end of the 80s, beginning of the 90s, when they were building the, the uh, whole area that's now ended up being you know, sort of offices and yeah. uh, restaurants and all that oh. sort of stuff. When they decided they were going to build that, it was, I think they were building it as a new news building at the right, time. Right, OK. And I went down the, I went down the side of that. I was like, oh, were you all right? Were you all right? You're yeah, perfect. no, I'm not fussed by stuff like that. Oh, you know, that's, that's fine. I abseil into work in the morning. <laughs> well, that doesn't no, no, surprise no, me. Perfectly fine. <laughs> the documentary, by the way, um, so this is to mark the 20th anniversary. Uh, it's Sony that have released a 30 minute long documentary for fans with never seen before uh, interviews with the Spider Man actors. Um, and so, uh, so this is uh, All Roads Lead to No Way Home. It's available to rent on Monday for free on most UK streaming services. Mm, very good. Uh, we'll be telling you what's coming up in just a moment. First, our phone-in today is inspired by one of our guests, a real-life dominatrix. 
fetch your cane. <laughs> After we met her, Vanessa Feltz uh, has decided to help you find your feet in your love life. Yes, maybe you've struggled to find the confidence to get back on the dating scene. Perhaps you're looking to rediscover the passion in the bedroom. And you might even have your uh, own success stories to share with us. Whatever your problem uh, or solutions, Vanessa will be here to take your calls. Yeah, give us a call for free on 08000 30 40 44 or download our free This Morning app to get involved. Please get in touch by 11.15 today and you must be 18 or over. Right, on with the show. Here's what's coming up. Dr Nigat's joining us with today's biggest health stories. What are we talking about today? Good morning, everybody. Have you been struggling to get a, an appointment with your NHS GP? We'll be talking about the national shortage of GPs. And did you watch the Davina McCall documentary last night as well? So we'll be discussing HRT shortages and the plans out of that, as well as what are the health benefits of walking slowly and drinking tea? All of that to come later on. Thank you. All right, we'll see you in a bit. Our Queen of Soap, Sharon Marshall, is back ahead of another big week in Soapland. So what have you got to tease us with today, Sharon? Well, more spider news. That seems to be the theme of the day. Um, spiders coming back to Corrie. I'll have all the gossip on that later. Right, Thank, you. Thank you. Cat Farmers here to showcase one of the high street's biggest trends. Tell us more. Well, it's suiting. We all know suiting is a year round staple, but this season there is something for everyone be it your favourite colour, be it your favourite style. I have got my pick of the high street here at 12.15. All right, we'll see you in a bit. Uh, we learn all about the world of Mistress Sophia, a real life dominatrix. That's at 10.30. Uh, Sarah Jossel begins her journey travelling across Italy. That's coming up at 11.45. And as he heads out on tour with Culture Club, we'll be talking four decades of great music and iconic looks with Boy George. That's at 5 to 12.